Hi folks, in this video I'm going to show you how to change the subtotal uh, background colors and font colors in a pivot table. So you can see here we have a pivot table chart um, and we've got a subtotals by, let me drag that across, by inventory, inventory transaction ID and by date. So in this instance what we want to do is we want to keep the font and the background color for each row as the default but we want to change the gray and black so the gray uh, background and the black font for the subtotals so how we do that is go into dimensions and for our inventory transaction ID we're gonna add equals or if row number equals zero comma so basically uh, click view treats all subtotals as a row number of zero so each row number in the chart that's not a subtotal will be given a sequential number from one until the end of the chart so in this instance we're saying if the row number is equal to zero in other words if it's a subtotal we want to make the background color let's say green click OK click apply so you can see we've now made the background uh, color green for the subtotal and for the text color we can say if row number equals zero comma y click OK click apply so now we've kind of we're making the subtotal stand out a little bit more. If we go into the expressions, we can we can do the same thing. So we go into background color and we'll say um, if row number equals zero, comma green. And for the text color, we'll say the same. If row number equals zero, comma white, and that's it. That's how you change the subtotal uh, background and font color um, within the pivot table. I hope that helps, and I'll see you next video. Cheers.